Brian Keith, Tyus Jones, Landry Shaman, a couple of veterans in the backcourt. Marvin against a Washington team that can score quickly and can score in bunches. Things can change. Short gets downhill, trying to dump it off to Chet Holmgren, but Chet Holmgren is standing on the baseline. A lot last night, Kuzma, little floater, that's good. And Kyle Kuzma over 22 points. A guy constantly blocking a guy at the rim without, and it just seems like it just disturbed uh, Zubac all night long for the Clippers. And that was part of the fit. Holmgren was a part of that. Particularly as the game went on, as there is Jalen Williams spotted up right in the corner. Legacy night, as well as under the legacy weekend. As Shea doing what he did, Lop Jones going to give it up, and it's Kuzma in transition. And that is what Watson likes to do. Let's get those easy points. This guy here doesn't get easy points. They make both well, these teams played last night. You wouldn't expect it, but what you're seeing right now. A lot of play to Chad Holmgren goes right to the cup, dismissing Kyle Kuzma for the two-handed stuff. Point guard as Bagley on the follow off that initial miss from Tyus Jones. Great job. The family environment that the Thunder at all has always created for the players. There is Josh Giddy in the in the Sons of the Thunder. Mr. Thunder is SGA. What is for? Sweet number four. The Thunder Legacy is still very much young, but growing. As Lou Dort. Double team to sink back before he kicked that pass out. And this time it's the Thunder in transition. Jalen Williams. That's his balance, his ability to understand. As Jordan Poole steps into that three, his ability. He does a good job of, of just waiting before his number is called. Changes to all season. He. Every play he makes the basket, it's all. Just maximum efficiency, so orderly in his game. Lethal scores today. And he's earned that right. He's worked his way down and to get rewarded. Instead of giving you two free throws, they give you one. And went to Detroit Tributes. And it's Kenridge Williams, back on the bottom of the net from three. So that three ball in the corner pocket for him, it's almost automatic because he's like locked and loaded. Boy, that is a nice hesitation. He had last year, Kenrich, almost the exact same spot. He's got the exact same result. Yeah. Oh. Kenrich, there's number three. This time it's a cut, and it's Kaysen Wallace right across the baseline. Continuing this scorching. And there is Kispert from the outside. He's dangerous. They, gotta, they don't want to leave Kendrick Williams open either. About and, and it finally drops in. All you have to do, folks, is pick that loose change up off the floor. Really open and can't connect from deep. In L.A. with Magic Johnson. And let's take a look at tonight's Paris. The amazing that you had to endure. Hey, you know what, man? I, I, I learned some, had some thick skin. <laughs> I'm a positive guy, man. Hard take right to the cup again. There's Chet Holmgren back on January 8th. How about that nice little scoop pass? Three last night. Bagley got fouled, and that one spins home. But there is Chet Holmgren again. Blocking a guy like Marvin Bagley. He's got and one. And now quick word from Jack in the Box. Remember, two basketball, and he seems to have one for it. And another guy that has an act for the basketball is Ian Wiggins. We talked about him. J Dub looking for space. Catch and shoot three. That is Jack Holmgren. And hard down the lane. Runs into Davis. Left handed shot. Somehow had just enough control. Really good. And we're going to start to see a little separation. Second. The legacy name. Professor Cage, I am here. Okay, the okay. Present. You just heard that uh, a, a note there about. Oh, I thought I. Oh, come on. Under legacy night. Hey, good job. You don't have to stay after school. Just uh, stay with the players tonight. That was a very appropriate. <laughs> Thanks, Professor Cage. Okay. Oh. Oh. No. no. <laughs> the ball in the deck, and that's what he does. Dangerous from the outside, and he's provided a boost. Attack of Bulldogs. Hayward. Floats it up, got it up over Kuzma, and there's his. Been extremely efficient down low, not just on dunks, but some of those plays in between. Mark Dagnall, patience that he's had to have, the strength that he has to have just to go to different moves. We see that floater, also the spin move that he can go to. 
Kispert this time will drive and Corey Kispert. Thunder going to enter a stretch once again with a on that sideline pass from Josh Giddy to get the ball inbounded. SGA. Even the Wizards in it. Nice cut. There is Getty. Wide open lane in the front. Turn the corner on Dort. Muscled it up somehow, even with Lou Dort right on his. Kuzma, just a skilled scorer. Knows what to do. Holmgren once again. That's the. He's trying to back down Omarui. Off balance. Boy, he thought he got pushed. Kispert's at the line. Closing in on that. Thunder rookie record. He's got 15 already. Chasing that other guy on the floor. With that number three jersey on. In a variety of ways. And that's what makes him one of the games. Holmgren spots up yet again. That three is good. Chet Holm. He wants a three. And got the three. But the 72.7% ties an okay has been transition defense. Washington really likes to play basket out on the break, and he said... Had just five threes, and all of a sudden, that's two threes back-to-back, -back, one from Tyus Jones and one from Tim. Not a great defensive team. One of the worst defensive teams in the NBA, and J-Dub's going to get... They win it overtime and lost. There is Chet Holmgren. That's a great point. That's true. As Bagley feathers it up and in. <laughs> I was thinking you, you, you probably didn't play hard till you're th <laughs> going on. Oh, I'm a Josh just staying with it on that play. Extra pass over the door. Open three and that corner three. It's the bottom of the possible. And there's Jed Holmgren yet again putting the ball on the floor. The pass is going to always move the defense basically out of contention. And Bagley yet again. Ball seems to be fun. Outside of his country, doing a lot of partnerships and collaboration and designs, but just continuing to stay creative. Far, just 21 combined points. And literally from the outs for his offense. It was Washington who traded up in the draft to get him, and Shea goes right. Consecutive games now. Look at what he's done on the floor. And Kalibali, nice move. Youngest player in the league on opening night, and Josh Giddy. Wheels around into that running hook shot. And Kalibli missed the initial shot, and there's a putback and a. Oh. You know, that is a very good question about what that particular shot. Uh, considering Kareem was the all time leading scorer in the NBA, that would be the most indefensible shot because that's what he used all the time to become the all time leading scorer. When you look at all the greats in that other guys had signature shots. You think about like the dream shape Kareem had. He, he could just beat you a million different ways. Think about some of the top scores. LeBron doesn't have a signature. Yeah. I'm amazed. Right, right, yeah, that's one of the few times we, <laughs> we never get. Thunder just continue to pour it on here, folks. And there's a guy that can take a charge. Because when he takes that charge, you at least know that you're going to get the ball. I don't know what you're talking about right now with my church league uh, teachers. Because this, you know, thanks for the <laughs> a, a huge advantage on the defensive end, but you got to also want to commit to it, too. Well, well that's the key. Can they get out of system or get rattled? And that's why they put themselves in this position, because they've worked. And now quick word from Jack in the Box. Yeah. Isaiah Joe, he isn't struggling at all, particularly with that shot. Had a big shot in the secondary and got it back in scores. What about how they've been able to answer the game tonight after the big emotion plus 500 record playing against some tough, some tough ball clubs, and you start out of play. And Mark Daniel has done a great job. Time. Shea spins, kicks, three, Wallace, late final frame, Jalen Williams, Gordon Hayward, Kenrich Williams, Jason Wallace. It all started in that first quarter with Kenrich knocking down the oh. As Bagley's going to get fouled in transition, you, you think back to that game. And it's Mark Daniels' 39th birthday today. We have it's in my draft class. I'll tell you that. You look more like 29. 
minutes here for Gordon Hayward. Coming in, getting familiarity, getting some run. Jason Wallace continues to at this time, you know, with his new teammates. And Wallace just continues to show you his range. Drafted, you can go to the G League, you can be undrafted. He's one of those guys. He didn't look like it on that play. A little extra bounce, too. That's a hard take from Buck. Trying to run a little offense here. Flagler got caught. That's the screen from Biambo. Champagne is going to be the last to touch it out of bounds. This is. Y'all don't understand looking out for me. I'm just waiting on you to look out for me. You just every night. <laughs> Yeah, you're looking out for Gallagher. We're going to prove to 23 and 6 as Wallace brings another three. The Thunder are going to be on the road for five out of the next six games. Uh, this is Houston Rockets. And that three for Case Wallace. 141 points on each season high. Wiggins, top. And somehow still able to bank it in. Impressive. Showing his length. Deontay Johnson, no on the reverse. Wiggins open and counted. And nice take by Jared Butler. As Baldwin, former Golden State Warrior. Missed a couple of in this game. Even though they somewhat kept it.